This episode of Openly Hostile Opinions has been brought to you by Private Internet Access. Private Internet Access provides state-of-the-art, multi-layered security with advanced privacy protection using VPN tunneling. When you use Private Internet Access, not even your ISP can tell what you're doing online. Prevent throttling and other people from eavesdropping on what you do. If you want to help out Openly Hostile Opinions and get yourself this wonderful VPN package, go to ohonet.pw slash ohovpn. Again, that is ohonet.pw slash ohovpn. Sign up for private internet access today. What's up, bitches and bitchesettes? Bitchettes? What, what's up, all you motherfuckers? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Greg's high right now. No, I'm just joking. God, I wish. <laughs> Greg fucked up. Yeah. So, uh, Be- sorry for those of you who might have been sitting in the old... The old uh, it wasn't my phone. Yeah, we were getting ready. Jarrett put the fucking thing <laughs> yeah. on the I cord. did not. Yeah. Why is the cord directly behind me? I don't um, know. Because that's where, where where there's outlets in this fucking trap. Yeah, this know. this house, I think, fucking is a three-bedroom, and it has, like, two outlets in the whole house. <laughs> it's fucking bullshit. And both of them are in here. Yeah. Kind of exactly. feels that way. But uh, how's everyone doing on this warm heat wave of a Tuesday? Because it's in its 30s. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I'm wearing black today, you know, like uh, they did at the Golden Globes to support nothing. Um, <laughs> okay, then. You what? guys didn't hear about that? No. No. Oh, uh, man. I did. I go to work and I sleep now. That's oh, you I go to work and you sleep. Yeah. yeah, everyone at the Golden Globes were like black and shit like that to so show their support for molestation and all this shit. I'm like, what'd you do? Uh, it, 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 it's not support for molestation. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. You know what I mean, but. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Your wearing, name's Billy. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm wearing all black to uh, show that I'm helping. Okay. I'm helping. <laughs> you hate slacktivism. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. That's that's what it is. So uh, I thought I'd wear black to help. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> so uh, yeah. Uh, by the way, a quick shout out to Tuffy. Uh, he opened uh, his his shirt we sent him on air. So that's cool. Um, he's not even in here at the moment, though. That Where the fuck bastard. is he? Yeah, he's usually on here hitting, hitting on Greg by now. Yeah. See, if he <laughs> doesn't show up this time, then he's going to be all disappointed. Yeah. It's, it's okay. Uh, you know, I'm surprised that anybody watches this fucking show. People watch this show? Yeah. They and, do. Uh, we don't know why. Oh, uh, and when people do watch this show, they are probably constantly disappointed, like my sex life. Right, Greg? Right. Okay, deal. That's, uh, that's not nice. Yeah. Why don't we just go ask your girlfriend? Uh, I don't here. know what you're talking about. I haven't had a girlfriend in 15 years. Um, she deserves better than you. you no, she ass. doesn't. I treat her like fucking gold. Don't even go there. Uh huh. Why, sure why is she with me? Why is she with me? Oh, never mind. It's Low self esteem. because of the dick. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, no beer of the week again this week because I forgot and uh, Jay's still poor. Uh, yeah, I don't get paid for another like two weeks yet. So. Yeah, Jay's in between jobs and I just keep fucking forgetting. Well, I got one. I get I paid just... tomorrow, but if I get caught buying beer, it'd probably be bad. Oh, yeah. that would be bad. Yeah, that probably would be bad. <laughs> even though there's documented proof that you're not consuming it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, why did you take down that sign? Yeah, I shouldn't have pointed it? to the sign. I don't know what you're he, he talking about. It down pretty quick. <laughs> it's I don't, over there somewhere. Yeah, I don't know what sign you're talking about, Chelsea. It's the one that says Casey loves Megan. That's what it. That's it what it said. It definitely said that. Uh, so moving on. Um, <laughs> <laughs> what a bitch! Fuck you guys. I treat her like gold. I, I no no yeah, woman like a in, golden tampon. Yeah, no <laughs> woman in this world gets treated better than she does. So. Oh my god. You are so full of shit, your eyes are turning brown. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, Mandy, I decided oh, to change my name. Up. I didn't want to be associated with Jay. Ouch. Jesus Christ. Did it just get cold in here? <laughs> Who wrote that fucking sign anyways? I don't know. Oh, probably, probably Chelsea. Chelsea. I, thought I, it was, I thought it was Jay. Yeah. Not the L word. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I updated my profile photo. Yes, you did. Yeah. My lovely wife, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, I think uh, <laughs> we, were, we were just talking before we got on the... Uh, Got on the show. Jay looks like a fatter James Hetfield today. More yeah! than ever. More than ever. <laughs> Ooh. I think he always looks like Stop James Hetfield. <laughs> I think he always looks like James Hetfield, but uh, today he really, really looks like uh, I got a haircut. Yeah. That's what it is. I got the a haircut. Cowardly Lion got a haircut. Yeah, I kind of trimmed that shit. It was getting a little unruly. Oh, yeah. Um, that reminds me. Uh, do you guys know the clothing company H&M or something? Uh, yeah, I know did, where you're going you, with did that. Did you guys hear about that? I know no. where you're going with that. Greg, you didn't hear about it? No. So apparently H&M, I don't know who the fuck they were until yesterday. Uh, they posted a little black kid, I'd say about six, seven years old, and he's wearing one of their new shirts. 
a sweatshirt. Yeah, okay. and it said the coolest monkey in the jungle. <laughs> nice. That kid was dark too. Yeah, he was Wesley Snipes black. <laughs> like, it, 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 he's one of them ones that if you turn the lights out, you wouldn't see him unless he smiles. <laughs> yeah, and uh, people are freaking out. I, I think they're overreacting, but whatever. That'd be like putting <laughs> Casey's little sour cream ass in a T-shirt that says uh, 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 the, the crunchiest cracker in the box. <laughs> exactly. Uh, sour cream looking motherfucker. You didn't hear about that, Greg? That's it. No, like I said, I work and I sleep. <laughs> That's basically what Considering I Considering our show is basically pop culture, that kind of sucks. <laughs> Where's your homework, Greg? God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, he does more show prep than we do. Actually, for our... Um, I set the computer up and then I disconnected it, so fuck you guys. <laughs> <laughs> you got halfway there. <laughs> yeah, ne- yeah, next week for our Patreon-only show, we should have... Uh, Greg's relapse. <laughs> oh, nice. It was a lapse, motherfucker. <laughs> no, twice. No, no, I mean, like, for the Patreon only show, we should just sit here and smoke crack. <laughs> I'm in. But we have to open a window because crack smells like shit. It does. <laughs> Tastes like shit, too. Oh, it smells so fucking bad. I wouldn't know. Yeah. Well, um, you'll know next week. But like I was saying, uh, I'm surprised, Jay, you're pretty good with pop culture and stuff. You didn't, you didn't see all the Gold Globe shit? I did. I did, yeah. No, uh, um... I have been in training for this new job I'm doing right now, and I know most of the stuff already. You know how to troubleshoot networks and shit. Mm-hmm. So I sit there and play my phone all day. So I've done nothing but read news stories. Oh, did you hear he part. leveled up too? I level. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, tech, he went from one. He leveled two up to level two. Is this World of Warcraft? Yeah, he leveled up. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize. Ding and everything. Oh, you, I thought yeah. I was going to be level one. I'm level two tech support. Uh, so what, what the fuck does that mean? I mean, uh, it means I can remotely reboot your uh, wireless gateway. Oh geez, that sounds hot. <laughs> sounds like some hot stuff. Wait, so so Chelsea said she has some crack and it's not for sale. So that it's free. Are free ta- free drugs. Chelsea, are you talking about, you know, the drug or you know your pussy? Oh. I think she's oh, trying I thought, to get I I, talking about the drugs. <laughs> I don't know. That's no, that's not very nice. No one Chelsea, I don't I don't know. She a hoe for show. <laughs> Greg, we have to talk. <laughs> Shit, what did I do? <laughs> you you exist. Yeah, and Fuck. um like we were saying about the Golden Globes or whatever like that, I thought it was just funny that they're all wearing black because of all this women oppression bullshit and stuff like that. And everyone's like, well, what did you do? Your girlfriend's wearing black right now. Well, that's because she worships Satan. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, or she is Satan. Uh, I just thought it was funny because I was like, did they even raise any money for anybody or anything? Or just like, I'm pretty sure it's to bring awareness, which is the laziest type of. Uh, I know. Like, what would you call it? Slacktivism. Slacktivism, yeah. Like, that's such a good word for it. And I guess some bitch wore like a red dress and they were complaining about and she's like what i like red well it's like it's like a fucking the, the the kneeling thing which you know i get the point what you're trying to make it all but you're not doing anything yeah why don't you take some of them fucking millions you make every year to play a children's game and donate it to some charities and shit how about that yeah exactly because you know they were all like oh we're dressed in black to show blah 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 and some guy was like yeah you know what i did today he's like i just donated a bunch of money so schools that don't have heat can <laughs> <laughs> exactly yeah and it's like well, what the fuck are you doing i don't know and uh plus oprah winfrey is gonna run for president uh, you know what? Let me let me just jump in on that for a second. <laughs> I'm glad you brought that up. I'm not going to get super political here, but I will say this thing. We have just learned what happens when you elect somebody who has no experience in politics to mm-hmm. office. Yeah. If we would do that again just because she has progressive ideals, mm-hmm. we deserve what we get. I know, exactly. That's all I'm going to say. And, th- and this is what I want to say about it, you know, because we really don't po- talk about politics a lot on here. But, um... If anything we should learn from this, it's uh, that people do want to change. Um, it's not probably the best change, but it just shows, I think, that we're sick of the normal politician. You know what I mean? Right, but we see that when you don't elect a politician, you accomplish jack shit nothing. So what good would it be to put another non-politician yeah. into that position? We yeah. we've lear- we should learn. Yeah, exactly. If we don't learn, then we deserve the bullshit we're going to get. And plus, she has like and a it's lot It's fucking of- Oprah Winfrey. Yeah. Do you really want to say, say Madam President to Oprah fucking uh, Winfrey? She has a lot of dirt. Like, she just, she had some school she opened and she was trying to cover up a sex scandal with it. Well, she didn't cover it up, but they well, covered you, it. The headmistress or whatever. I know, but still, it's just like fucking weird, dude. I don't know. They like, opened this gilded palace in, let, in Africa. Oh, it was in Africa. Oh, yeah, it was in Africa and it was supposed to like be for these underprivileged girls and shit and it girls was, that were circumcised <laughs> right well it had like a, a, a spot you look confused about that Greg well you've never heard of female circumcision yeah they, no. they cut the clit right the fuck out yeah they cut your pussy lips and the clit off and then they take these ropes and they tie your legs together so it doesn't get infected because they don't think sounds hot yeah exactly I love it <laughs> 
Like, uh, it's a porn category for me. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, they do it because they don't think women should uh, have pleasure during sex, which I, I truly am for. Because <laughs> then they can't be hoes. <laughs> they, can't, they can't run off and be hoes again. They could be. Yeah. That's... Such, such, such a hey, lovely, man. Hey, man. lovely stance to have. Hey, or whatever. You know, women, women are hoes for show. <laughs> anyway, though, uh, she she opened this school in, in Africa and shit, and then the headmistress got caught raping the kids and oh, shit. Oh, nice, nice. Oh yeah, it was a, it was all sorts of lovely, and you know, and then um, she she believes in like mysticism and bullshit. You know, like uh, science has no place with them for Oprah Winfrey. I remember she like. Oh really? Yeah, uh, years ago there was. I she, forget. Wait, the she doesn't believe like any any science. No, 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 no. That's not what I'm saying. Oh. Like years ago, she was on um, the show and somebody had cancer, mm-hmm. and she was like recommending this quack ass remedy and shit, which doesn't <laughs> work. It, well, what was it? She was like, "Hey, stop getting cancer." <laughs> yeah. Well, or like that guy that we had who sprayed doom bug spray in people's oh, faces. Oh, that was great, dude. Heal, that heal was so myself. amazing. No, there's actually a bunch of stories. Um, I think it happened a couple years ago. This person, one of their kids, and a family had pancreatitis really bad or whatever, and it exploded. And right. instead of the parents taking it to the hospital, they just put their hands on it and prayed. Um, oh, those those Christian scientists. Yeah. People. Big surprise. The kid died. They're loony. <laughs> the kid died, and. Uh, yeah, they got in deep shit. I, you know, I'm a, I'm all about practicing religious freedom and all that shit. But if your religion actively kills people, probably not such a good thing. Yeah, exactly. Like Allah Akbar, <laughs> <laughs> photo bomb. Right, Greg. What? <laughs> Are oh. you just thinking about drugs? Yeah, you're over there like half asleep. Like God, I yeah. They, these drugs. they said they have crack out there. So, oh really? He's he's just listening. He has he has not been keeping up with. The, the current event. No, actually, I fell day. asleep there for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, it looked like you did a little bit. You do uh, you do tend to work evenings, so, you know. Do you have to go to work right after this? Yeah, directly. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm going to leave here and go straight to work. It's awesome. <laughs> so, how how's the, the graveyard shift working out for you? I fucking hate it. I, I, was never, <laughs> I was never a fan of the graveyard shift either. I don't mind working, like, into the late evening, but I don't want to work overnight. You should see how much coffee I drink. It's fucking, that's my new addiction. Well, we, that's been coffee. clear. Coffee. Yeah, Lots that, of it. That's what I said. I should start mainlining it. Probably <laughs> I remember when you effective. first came in here, you're like walking in circles. I'm like, well, it looks like Greg stopped doing drugs, but he replaced it with caffeine. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> first, he's going to smoke some crazy. Oh, crack. He yeah, goes, that'd probably keep me awake for, smoke for about some 10 crazy. minutes. <laughs> the hubby hates it. The hubby hates what, Mama? I'm sorry. Crack? <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought that's what, I thought we were still talking about crack. I don't know, crack kills. Crack kills. No, but um, speaking of drugs, like... I get why there's an opiate addiction. Um, I've only done heroin like a long time ago, like in a galaxy far, far away. Ben Swallow. Um, ben Swallow 420. <laughs> um, <laughs> but Christ. Uh, I didn't really like it. I was young and stuff like that. It just got sick to my stomach and I puked. But, um, no, that just meant you were really high. Yeah, probably. Yeah, uh, Painkillers pain and shit like that, though, I love. It's the same fucking thing. I know, but it's intensified with heroin. I think that's why you puke and everything. But like Percocets and stuff, oh, I love them. I'm like that meme where that guy's touching his face. <laughs> but Percocets are the same fucking... I know, I know but heroin's oh, like... They're, they're off by a few molecule, molecules or yeah, whatever. It's, it's, it's synthetic same, heroin. Same, same yeah, exactly. It's just not as... The difference is you know what you're getting. Yeah. Like, with heroin. Yeah. It's just like, you know... might be fucking rat poison. Yeah. It's probably like... probably, play, probably why you got sick. Yeah, it's probably like play sand in it. <laughs> oh, Kenny's here. What's up, Kenny? What's up, Kenny? Uh, from like one of those uh, old school little tykes... Uh, turtle same things <laughs> yeah you know what i'm talking about <laughs> i'm pretty i'm pretty sure your uh, girlfriend just offered to suck my wife's dick you want a dick nice. suck or crack amanda <laughs> you uh, said that like an asian person you want ducks you want dick suck <laughs> you want dick suck uh speaking of um uh asian stuff i saw a great movie last night with jackie chan in it yeah it's what's that co- it? it's uh shit <laughs> the foreigner that's the name of the movie yeah it's called shit <laughs> uh it's called the foreigner pierce brosnan's in it um, I, my favorite one with him is Operation Condor. But yeah. Anyway, uh, Jackie Chan uh, has his daughter that dies in an explosion, um, and it talks a lot about it's into like the old Irish, um, uh, like stuff, uh, the Irish Civil War shit like that. And uh, Jackie tries to find who killed his daughters, and he like stalks Pierce Brosnan because he thinks he knows. Jackie Chan plays like a little evil guy, and it. it's sort of good. It's really good. If you love Jackie Chan, I'd suck his dick. Uh, watch it. It's called The Foreigner. 
and uh, they're deal dr- they're dealing drugs in our chat right now. <laughs> yeah, I just noticed that. I just saw. I thought they were free. What the fuck? Yeah. Um, we're, we're reading about crack and stuff in here, and I just see fifty bucks. I'm pretty sure there's a deal going on here. Is that how much crack is? Is fifty bucks? Greg. You would know, Greg. <laughs> <laughs> He's just like Greg. Oh yeah. How right. much is it for an eight ball of crack? I don't fucking know. <laughs> Never like, had that much money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. Like, always, I usually buy it fifty dollars at a time. <laughs> He's like, yeah. "Them's my forgetting days." I don't remember that shit so much. Right. Oh, Chelsea said. Oh, I think Chelsea says she'll suck dick for fifty bucks. I only have like thirty four dollars. Right so so. thirty four dollars. So are you both offering to suck my wife's dick at the moment? <laughs> Your wife has a dick, apparently. Well, uh, I don't know where she hides with it. With all the trans pedo and shit going on, who knows? <laughs> oh, the, cra- the crack is a bonus. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Nifty 50. <laughs> yeah. See, that's why I'm friends with them. They're so giving. <laughs> Especially Megan. She can't keep her legs closed. <laughs> oh, you are such an ass. I'm just joking. She only opens to me that what? I know of. Why the hell does the chat stop scrolling? Does that happen to you ever? Because your computer uh, sucks. No, actually. It happens to me all the time. Uh, sometimes, like, did you just ban someone or anything? No. Because when you ban someone, it stops the chat, and you have to scroll back down to keep it going. I, I'm logged into my own account. Oh, uh, okay. That's probably why, then. Uh, it's doing it automatically for me. They're closed now. Yeah, I'm surprised, Megan. Yeah, actually. you're done. <laughs> actually, you, they probably she's won't She's telling be. you you're done. <laughs> actually, they probably won't be. I cooked for her today, and she loved it, and it made her horny, I think. <laughs> Kenny wants to know how many stars do you give the Chacky Chan movie? Um... I'd say four out of five. Uh, yeah. Four, four out of five little chinkies. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Four out of five uh, Asian stereotypes. <laughs> it's, uh, it's fucking amazing. Uh, I loved it. Jackie Chan uh, always plays good characters in movies, and in this one he sort of plays a darker, um, a little darker, I, I don't know what you would call it, um, good, good bad guy. Uh, I guess basically the whole moral of the story is is don't push a good guy. <laughs> so he's an anti-hero? Yeah, basically is the best I'm way a, to say I'm it. a fan. I'm a fan of anti-heroes. Yeah, stories. me too. Uh, that's why I like, like the Punisher. That's why he's like, because I see him as like an anti-hero. Did you watch any other Marvel stuff? Uh, me? Yeah. I have not. Oh, I, okay. I've just been... Because I know I you work like, a weird shift now, so I don't have a, like, yeah. a lot of time. Because I know you like... You to... work at home. <laughs> yeah, but I... What is wrong with you? I still have to like... Pay attention. E-T-5. I would oh. love to turn the TV on. That's and ignore a, I, it. absolutely what I would be doing. <laughs> I did I, that shit when I was an IT manager. And if I, I could have four monitors, one of them was a movie. This one was Facebook. And when I <laughs> when I actually get on the the call floor, then I, that's exactly what I'm going to do for my downtime. But yeah, I don't think I could work from home because I've never worked. You're right. <laughs> uh, I'd be, I'd be I'm sitting in my underwear masturbating all yeah, day. Yeah, like what's this stuff under the sink? Glug, glug, glug. <laughs> I'm actually not having a hard time with it. Really? Surprisingly, yeah. I thought I would. I thought I would be like get lazy and like I don't want to go up there. there. But I've been. I've been good. Is there certain times you have to do, or do you? Get oh pants? no, yeah. I have scheduled work times. Oh, I just. Okay. I could work without. Is pants. it full time? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh shit. Nice. Uh, I just pants are optional. Pants are optional. <laughs> it's like my. It's like that side. at my job too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you'll get welder burns. Well, it is a vacuum cleaner store or a <laughs> right. factory, so right. of course pants. Are no, the they optional. make fucking everything now. They make what fucking else they fans. Make? Fans. Yeah, that's that's what we're doing right now. I have now. enough of those because I'm awesome. <laughs> no, like these big ass fucking shop fans. Hmm. Nice. Mop so, buckets, fucking oh, toolboxes. Mop, mop buckets. Yeah, I was making God, mop buckets. How do you go thing. from fucking? Um, I don't. I think we make more other shit than like vacuum cleaners. Vacuum. Now. I don't even see vacuums anymore. Well, that's like Jason, our neighbor. He works for Dish, and now they're fixing fucking dishwasher or not dishwashers, uh, washing machines, dryers for Samsung. I didn't even know Samsung made fucking washers. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. I just whatever. Uh, I just found out they mentioned Rhodey in from Iron Man in Doctor Strange. I'm a nerd. I haven't seen Doctor Strange yet, actually. Um, I never really followed him a lot, so I guess that's why I've been putting it off. But I would I was just mentioning that to Jay because I know he likes uh, stuff about the hand and uh, mm-hmm. the Defenders and Iron Fist. They talk a lot about the hand. Iron Fist wasn't that good, actually. I thought it was really fucking strange. Yeah, actually, I I don't particularly love the hand, isn't it? like a character i'm just aware of them i, I actually yeah. don't really like daredevil comics all that much uh-huh. uh they're okay mm-hmm. uh, um some some comics i really love and, and some i kind of eh, yeah take her to leave it yeah as far as the marvel shit's concerned though like i i, I was a big x-man fan uh-huh. and i love pretty much anything that's connected with the x-men but i was more of a dc guy wow okay. like uh batman yeah uh, was my shit What's the side of spaghetti? Yeah. 
if anyone hasn't seen that yet, there's this old video of this kid, and he's dressed up like Batman, and he does this little funny video, and it's so fucking hilarious. Oh, yeah. Like, his mom asks him what he wants for dinner, and he just goes, justice. Kid's like 21 yeah. now. And he's like, with a side order of spaghetti. <laughs> there's, there's, some, there's some guy on Facebook, they call it... Uh, a bat dad or something. No, yeah, oh, yeah, he's, he's funny. Yeah, me, me and Jay watch that all the time. That shit's funny. He, 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 His wife is is got to be the most patient human being. I know, <laughs> dude. I, Jen! <laughs> she's sort of hot, though. Like, I would fuck the shit out of her. Like, with the bat mask Jen on. is indeed good looking. <laughs> like uh, they're, they're fucking loaded, too. You look at oh, their yeah. house, man. They're oh, stacked. Yeah. Definitely. That's why he's probably doing it. He's bored. Rich yeah. people have no like so much time on their hands. That's why they do drugs. They're just bored. Like, I swear, every every rich guy knows. Is that why guy. I started, maybe? Yeah, probably. probably. Yeah, know. your life is going too well, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> so, fuck this shit. My life's going pretty well right now. I just know you something bad's going to happen. start smoking some crack. I know. Like, it's going too well. Like, something bad's going to happen. My life is going way too good right now. Just smooth. Actually, it's not going that great. It's just, I have money problems, like always. Fucking Christmas killed me, dude. Yeah, at least you have a girlfriend now. It's cool. Nah, Megan I, says Casey hates me now. Oh, my God. Don't don't be don't be that, that girl. Don't. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Have some self-esteem. What do you mean now? I, get that. I don't get that. <laughs> I told you you were ugly. Yes, I did because you I wrote it. it. You wrote it on your car. Megan's upset because she wrote ugly on her car, and above it, I wrote yes, you are. <laughs> uh, baby, because that's fucking horrible. <laughs> it's not horrible. It's uh, it's how we flirt. His, uh, Mama Bear says uh, his kids kill me. Yeah, I, you know what? I love that, it. That's... Yeah, I love it when uh, my favorite thing he always says is. Tables are for glasses, not asses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he, well, every time his girl, his little girl talks about dating, he's like trying to get her not to like boys. <laughs> he's like, girls rule, boys rule. <laughs> Shania, what's a bay? I don't know. Here's twenty dollars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is pretty funny. He's still doing it though. He's been doing it for a long time, man. Yeah, he started out on Vine when Vine was a thing. Yeah, Vine is no longer a thing. They're they're bringing it back though. Um, not Twitter is doing it, but somebody else is is like creating the original developers. I guess are making a, a Vine clone. Yeah, and there's they're actually it um, different a YouTube thing now, and I forget how it works. I don't know if it's a certain channel or what, but there's a lot of vines on YouTube now where you can go to a certain part of YouTube and just look at vines. So I know I don't know if they bought them or or what. But uh, speaking of YouTube, I actually want to talk about something. Um, did you hear about that guy, that famous YouTuber, Logan Paul? Yeah, or, Logan Paul, that jackass. Yeah, filmed some guy hanging himself in a tree, put it on YouTube. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Is this still up? I want to watch that. <laughs> no, I think, I think it got taken down. He's getting a lot of shit for you know it. What, you know what bothers me about uh, YouTube? And since we're YouTubers, this could probably bite us in the ass later. But you know what? We don't monetize our videos, though, so it don't matter. Yeah. But you know what? They bother- don't make money from us, so they don't give a shit. Yeah, they <laughs> They don't monetize their videos anyway, but um, one of the things that bothers me about YouTube is it, like they don't know what they are or what their own rules are. They never really set them. They're perfectly content to let the advertisers decide what's going to be okay on yeah, the platform. Exactly. It's it's sort of like a, a a different version of a corporate, you know, board and stuff yeah, like that. And, and, and they make sh- all the decisions exactly. And that, you know, there shouldn't be like any kind of censorship on YouTube and shit. It's yeah. not a TV. Station. Of course, Megan knows where you can find it because she's a sick fuck. <laughs> she's with you. She's got to be. Uh, it's on Live Leak. If you want to watch it, Greg. No, I was th- kidding. Oh, okay. I don't really want to watch uh, that. Mama Bear says his fan base is kids. I assume we're still talking about Bat Dad. That very well may be so. Yeah. Um, uh, what? But what we're big kids. Say? Bat Dad. Not, not Logan Paul that showed a guy hanging himself. No. Who, or or, <laughs> or is dad, it Logan Paul? Uh, whatever his name is. Fucking Paul Logan. or He has two first names. I know that. But a lot of people don't even think it's real. They think he staged it, but I don't know. I, do, I didn't well, look a lot into it. I just see him all over the place. And I guess he has a really strong fan base. And people that are going against him are, like, sending death threats to these people's houses that are, like, standing against him and all this shit. And it's like, come on, dude. This isn't a high school. Uh, yeah, oh, like he did something Paul. that he shouldn't have done. Admit it. <laughs> like you know what I mean. Well, yeah, that's not the coolest thing in the world to do. But I, I still believe that you should be able to do whatever. Yeah, exactly. And and the, the thing is, is like what I'm I'm upset about is is like when he showed the guy hanging there, he didn't go and fuck him in the ass. That's what I'm pissed about. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? His brother is also a, a pretty famous YouTuber, Jake Paul. Oh, okay. And. uh well, he was on a, a TV show that my kids watch. It was a bad iCarly ripoff called Bizarre Vark. 
<laughs> and an uh, iCarly ripoff. Oh my god, it so is. It so is. It, it's it's like Disney's version of iCarly from back in the day. They got these two girls doing a web. Like, I, I couldn't watch videos. that show. It made me horny. <laughs> oh, anyway. <laughs> well then, what the fuck is wrong with you? Uh, fucking Harvey Weinstein uh, over here. Uh, anyway, no. <laughs> it's gross. cold out here. It was in the teens, and so was I. <laughs> oh, gross. God damn Death. pedophiles. <laughs> Any. <laughs> Jesus I'm oh, sorry, I had to. It was a good joke. Good joke. Stop good joke. breaking the law, asshole! You're why Corey Feldman is sad. He just wrote a book, I guess. Uh, uh, probably. Yeah, he wrote his book about his uh, kid touching days. Or what is, what is this one? I don't know. What's it say? Stop making the... F- f- or, yeah, hit. I don't like them putting chemicals in the water <laughs> that turn the friggin' frogs gay. <laughs> there you go. Oh, that's funny. Now, what were you saying, Jeff? Uh, yeah, anyway, he got fired from Disney... For doing something, and I have no idea why. <laughs> but he's also a douchebag YouTuber. Yeah, there, there's a lot of them. Like, there's this one guy I can't say. His name is Onision. He's a fucking dirtball. And he's been, like, really, really in trouble for, like, kidnapping women, taking them from their family and shit like Whoa. that. Whoa! Yeah, it's, it's bad, dude. And he's one of those people that get on there and preach about how much he hates the Bible and shit like that. And he, he's fucking weird, dude. It's just, like... And everyone's like, yo, why do you hate the Bible so much? He's like, because it's full of hate and stuff. I'm like, how is it any different from what you're doing? <laughs> like, God, fucking, I don't know, fucking hypocrites. That's all I see in this goddamn world is hypocrites. Bunch of piece of shit fucking assholes. <laughs> yeah, you know, the other ones, too, that uh, that have been in the news recently is the entirety of the band uh, Decapitated. Well, they were do accused know. of being <laughs> accused of gang raping. Oh, who they gang rape? I uh, wish it was me. They just got off, I guess, but they they got to... Oh, did they? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's time for the rim shot. I don't know what the fuck it is. <laughs> That's a perfect time for the rim shot. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Didn't you read the scroll? <laughs> they, they were on tour in the U.S., and they, uh, a Los Angeles woman claimed she was held against her will and raped in the band's tour bus. Oh, great. Um, she probably deserved it. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> but wait, 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 wait. Since this happened, let's all wear black, because it helps so much. <laughs> uh, they're a metal band. They were already wearing black. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Jesus Christ. Pollock, Pollock metal band. Uh, Megan says, hey, Casey, how focused do you have to be when you play WoW? Really focused. You have to be super fucking focused. Yeah. Especially see, Greg, when you're healing. Yeah. Greg Fuck. knows. I don't heal anymore, but still, it sucks. Yeah. If I play again, I won't. You <laughs> never again. <laughs> you women in the chat right now are just, just filthy. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're exactly. They're smoking crack. What do you expect? See, just filthy. This is what happens when you give women rights. <laughs> they're worse than men. They're My worse God. than men. They are. They're worse than men. I know why back in the day Horrible. they had certain rooms that men only went in and women couldn't. Hey, do you remember? Uh, it's called a bathroom. Did you ever hear of the hysteria <laughs> thing? No, I didn't. Back in uh, back in the old timey days. Uh, old timey days. The old, the old hey, doll, how's days, it going? Do you want to go for a martini? Uh, women used to, to suffer from an ailment called hysteria. And the only way I to still do. So- yeah, the only way to solve that ailment was to... Uh, be manually stimulated by a doctor. Oh yeah, I didn't that's know why that. They invented but dildos. I, yeah, I didn't know why that, that's what they called it. But yeah, uh, you basically had two choices back in the fifties when you oh, were having a mental breakdown. That was the eighteen fifties. Whatever, because um, they did it in the fifties too. Um, you went to the doctors. You either got on uh, Valium, or they got you off. Right. Basically. Well, well, my point of that is, women found a way to like uh, even be filthy back then. They're like. Oh, oh yeah. I'm suffering from hysteria. Hey, Doc. Oh, yeah. Like, y- you know what they came out and said about male penises? They realized that... The male head- penises. Yeah. As opposed to female penises? Yeah, exactly. Well, who knows these days? You know, we don't know what <laughs> fucking bathroom to use. Uh, the the tip of the penis, they found out, uh, was for when you're fucking a wom- woman, uh, the mushroom part is there for pulling out other man's semen. That's what it is for. Because so, like, how do you find wait, this out? Wait, Was what? there a sacred text written? Uh, no, they were studying all sorts of animals that have penises like humans and stuff like that, and they were doing a bunch of research, and they realized that is what the tip of your dick is for. That is why it's like shaped like a mushroom. It helps pull all the semen out for when a woman gets fucked, so yours can get in there. So basically, scientifically, women are hoes. <laughs> Dad. <laughs> <laughs> On yeah. that note, if yeah. you're doing awful things on the internet, remember you need to have protection. <laughs> Make sure you yeah. sign up for with our sponsor of this show, uh, Private Internet Access. Go, <laughs> nice segue there. <laughs> go to ohonet.pw/ohovpn. 
get yourself some protection for when you're on the internet. And when you guys talk about disgusting, horrible things, uh, you <laughs> you'll be able to keep uh, the prying eyes away from 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 what you're doing. <laughs> so go to ohonet.pw/ohovpn. Yes. All right. uh, when you're researching all those mushroom dick right. semen polar outers. Continue, continue <laughs> on with there. I had to squeeze that in somewhere. Oh, uh, no, it's fine. That show. was a nice segue. I liked it. No, that, that was just basically it. So it showed that, you know. I had to squeeze that in there somewhere. Uh, Rim shot, Greg. <laughs> you're, you're slacking. He's he's probably asleep. I, was, I thought I wasn't allowed to touch the thing. <laughs> I gave it to you. Why do you think it's pointing towards you? What is it, a little boy? Jesus. <laughs> Actually, that reminds me. How's your kids? <laughs> oh my god! I haven't talked to them in like two weeks. I don't oh, know. Really? They could be dead. Who, Who are they staying with right now? My parents. Oh, they're not staying with cunt face, are they? Fuck no! She can't take care of kids. <laughs> can't take yeah, care of herself. She's probably happy to throw them back at what you. What was her name? I can't fucking remember. Felicio. Felicio. Felicio Hornblower. <laughs> She was just happy to throw them kids back oh, as she wasn't God, she? Man, she yeah. just she just looked like a fucking used condom. <laughs> <laughs> just see her now. Oh Jesus. I'm sure it's God. no better. Uh funny story. I think her dad might be watching this shit. <laughs> oh really? He's funny, dude. He cracks me up. <laughs> well, he's yeah, Dave's a good guy, but you know, like he, he knows what he raised. <laughs> <laughs> uh if you're watching Dave, hello, how are you doing? Um but anyways, uh is it okay if I tell the Facebook story? Yeah. So Greg texted me someday, and he's like, "Hey, Felicia just had another kid. Check out her Facebook page." And she's sitting there, just pushed, oh yeah, yeah just, fuck, just what? pushed the baby out, and her tits just hanging. Oh, out. on Facebook. <laughs> yeah, she, <laughs> yeah, her, Greg's like, "You see real anything? nice." Greg's like, "You see anything awkward?" I'm like, "Oh my god, her fucking tits hanging." Yeah, <laughs> and she put well, the mosquito Facebook. bite. She I think got one of there. her family members put it up or something. And yeah, <laughs> she might. It, she does have small titties because Facebook didn't even care. <laughs> Like they usually they, scan that they shit. They couldn't tell if it was yeah. male or female. They're, they're like, ah, that bitch she must be from Africa. She has a lot of mosquito bites. And that, that was basically it because it didn't it let her post it. Because when he showed it to me, it was still up. <laughs> it just thought it, 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 just thought it was a there. picture of Justin Bieber. <laughs> 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 bitch does look like Bieber, man. Uh, actually, that reminds me. We talk about sex dolls a lot on this show. We used to. We do? Yeah, we used to. Um, uh, way before anyone else did. <clears throat> uh and I guess they made one that looks just like Justin Bieber. Of course um, they did. They didn't mean to, but I guess it looks, and it's fucking selling like hotcakes. And what makes this model even greater is it has interchangeable penises. <laughs> Where did we get that at? <laughs> yeah, I know. That's what I was wondering. So I was thinking, I was like, yeah, if you, you know, you like uh, Justin Bieber, but you like a little of the uh, dark fever, you can change his penis to have a black dick. <laughs> Despacito. <laughs> gotta, gotta go for that caramel colored dick. Yeah. Uh, um, <laughs> yeah. So actually, we I, see, and that's why I w wish I was rich. Because if I was rich, I would just buy one of those sex dolls and put it behind us. <laughs> <laughs> so Greg, so it could rip out you the know what? not Greg. <laughs> right. You know what? Y'all need to become patrons right now and do like $20 because there's a, there's a Sears going out at the mall and they are selling the mannequins. And I would love to be able to put a mannequin up back here. Oh, really? That's fucking hilarious. I need tools. Maybe they're selling that shit cheap. Uh, they might be. See, that's why uh, Sears is awesome, man. That's Sears is when Bob Vila got all crazy and did like things with the Sears. craftsman. Yeah, and yeah. he sells all his shit. I love Bob Vila. I love him. I just love him from uh, Home Improvement because Tim <laughs> Allen fucking hated him. <laughs> oh, did Trevor get in the chat? Yeah, a while ago. Pay the fuck attention. Uh, no, I didn't see him on here. Uh, Duffy, Duffy came in. When'd you come in, Duffy? Yeah, I didn't. I didn't fucking see it. We 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 thanked you earlier for the uh, the props on the uh, the opening the the live unboxing, even though it was more unbagging of your t shirt. <laughs> Speaking of bags, what's up, Megan? Uh, <laughs> why do you put why, up? Why should mean your girlfriend? She, she likes, deserved better. She's. she's uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Um, but uh, yes, thanks, Trevor. Uh, Jay told me that you opened up the shirt on your. Um, yeah, that was Amazon. me watching. Casey couldn't be bothered to to to, to support you. Yeah, but, sorry. I was putting, but I love you. I was putting it in Megan's ass, slapping her in the face, telling her uh, she should have got a better grade on her uh, fifth grade report card. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you're probably one of those freaks. You're you're out like shopping for like school Catholic school girl outfits. Uh, yeah, I like it. Uh, you know, I like when girls dress up like that. Shit, the pig. I, I'm all about it. Like I love the pigtails, the fucking plaid skirts. The white stockings, braces. Um. <laughs> I enjoy being abused. And Megan says, we know. <laughs> you oh, she told does. us at great length. Yeah, like, I beat the fuck out of Megan during sex. Uh, but she deals with it for some reason because uh, me and her are both mentally disturbed, and that's why we get along. <laughs> there was once a time when Casey used to feel bad for how I treated her. Now look at him. <laughs> 
Yeah, exactly. You know, it's because Casey's a piece of shit. I did because Chelsea's really mean to her, and it's just uh, it's how she likes her attention. So, uh, you know, most people like their eggs sunny side wait, up. Wait, wait a minute. Does that, does that mean you two are fucking now, too? Who? Chelsea. No, uh, no, no, no. How uh, do you know? Because we don't want anyone to know that we are. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I have bruises all over. That would explain the long sleeve shirt and shit. <laughs> yeah, that's why she looks like a beatnik, too. <laughs> uh, you have to wear long sleeves when you have track marks. <laughs> He's like, uh-oh. I thought you were injecting that shit under your scrot. No, actually, I do. Fuck, no, that no, that would hurt. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> well, it doesn't What's hurt wrong you? with you? <laughs> Casey is the white O.J. Simpson. Uh, I haven't murdered anyone yet, actually. Uh, Megan, it's a thruple. Yeah, uh, Megan jokes around <laughs> and calls me, her, and Chelsea a thruple. Um, What's a thruple? It's as in throw up couple. No, it's like a three way relationship. <clears throat> a thruple, get it? I'm gonna fuck you both up. <laughs> I'm not black. I'm OJ. Drink apple juice. OJ will kill you. Um, <laughs> yeah, but it still I d- cracks me up that he's wandering around. He got it. He's the suing the Vegas. Loose. He's suing the Vegas nightclub now that threw him out. Oh, really? They're like, you better be careful. He has murdered two people. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. He he don't give up. Oh fuck, wait, dude. allegedly. <laughs> allegedly. Allegedly. Yeah. Um. He's murdered two people. Like you might want to, you know, be careful. I do. I do do things that make Chelsea uncomfortable though. Like when I kiss Megan, I touch her shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> Just to piss her off. I, I, you know what? I'm like that too. Like not, not when you're k- kissing Megan, you know. <laughs> but, but you know what? Uh, well, that's one of my biggest fucking pet peeves in the world. For those of you who can see on camera, when somebody talks to you like this, really, you don't like that? I fucking hate that. Why? Greg's getting uncomfortable right now. Look at him. I'm like what the his fuck best. Is going on. I'm like his best friend who he's known for like 15 years. Yeah, he's getting uncomfortable. See, that's so weird. <laughs> what I never the fuck is that? It's a chainsaw. I never knew. I never knew you hated that. I'm trying to think all through the times I've known you, Jay, if I've ever done that to you. I would have killed you. <laughs> oh, really? I'm going to do it now. I can't help it, dude. I'm just such an asshole. I know where your ticklish spots are. <laughs> that sounds so wrong. Yeah, I fucking hate being ticklish. You know what's funny? If you poke Casey in the side just right, he'll fart. Actually, <laughs> I had um, bacon-wrapped shrimp today with a, a cheddar cheese sauce. That sounds amazing. Oh, it was delicious. Um, but, uh, yeah, so if you probably did, I probably would poop. <laughs> uh, I got I got cheese flowing through these intestines and it ain't good. Duffy <laughs> says I have killed fifty thousand people. Yes, yeah, so have I. About in the bathroom earlier today, I was kind of bored. You got to get those numbers up, man. Those are rookie. Those are numbers. rookie numbers. <laughs> killed a lot of people in battlefield. Yeah, that's Fuck true. A lot. Hitler killed six million. Man, you got to you got to get those numbers up, man. Those are rookie, those are rookie numbers. numbers. <laughs> You can tell we watch too many memes. Have you guys yeah. seen the Ugandan Knuckles memes? No. Well, they're fucking ridiculous. <laughs> no. But I see memes inside of memes now. Like, you know the one where the guy's with the girl and he's looking back at the other one? Yeah. Yeah. Well, there's another one where this car is going down a highway. And right, right. The leper. drift. The drift well, meme. the car was the guy and the sign was the two girls. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I was just like, okay, okay. You know what's <laughs> funny now? The, the big meme right now is Tide Pods. It's just like the whole I'm going to drink bleach thing all over yeah, again. Yeah, what the fuck? I saw that, and that was like right when 2018 hit. Right when that hit. Oh, it it's the, like once a month. Yeah, it was the Logan Paul thing, and I just started seeing tight pods everywhere about how um, they're putting straws in them and just sucking the juices out of them. I kind of wish all these uh, quote-unquote depressed meme makers and yeah. shit who want to drink bleach or eat Tide Pods or whatever, just fucking do it so we don't have to listen to it anymore. Actually, it's pretty funny. I just got a whole bunch of Tide Pods for Christmas. <laughs> I was pissed, though, because I like gain. gain. I like the Gain ones. The Gain yeah, ones are better. Gain is my favorite fucking laundry detergent. I would funnel that shit in my butthole if I could. To be fair, though, the Tide Pods are pretty cool looking with I the know. pink and orange. I know, but I like the, the smell of Gain. It reminds me of, you know, a young three-year-old boy. Uh, that's why I'm not allowed to we're, we're three, playgrounds anymore. <laughs> we're three grown men who just went from making dick and fart jokes to talking about laundry detergent. Yeah, whatever. What is wrong with us? Um, so my mom for Christmas buys me a fucking huge, huge box of Tide Pods. Like, I didn't know they made them this big. And then she got my sister the gain ones. So you know what me and my sister did? Trade. <laughs> we traded a couple bags. It was like drugs. We're like, here you go, here you go. So you got stuff. You got this. I'm like all itching my neck. <laughs> Craig's like... Man, I'm I have flashbacks, brother. <laughs> uh, Casey also lo- enjoys getting pegged. Now, Megan wants to peg me, and I'm not into that shit. <laughs> what does that mean? I'd do it. Uh, it's when a girl puts a strap on and fucks a guy in the ass. Oh, I'd do <laughs> what's wrong with that? I'd do it. <laughs> Jay, listen to Jay. He's like, yeah, I'd get my milk, my prostate milked. Yeah, I don't got a problem with it. Uh, Greg is like, I'm surrounded by women. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, Gert, Gert, dudes, four. Hi, hi. What's up, man? If you're not a bot. 
<laughs> Duffy, that may, that haircut makes you look gay. I'm sorry. Your face makes you look gay. Uh, I ooh! <laughs> James Hetfield, ooh. Yeah! Um, they think I look like fat James Hetfield, so yeah, fuck you. You do. Uh, Trevor, I see that your uh, little Latina girl's in here. Did you propose to her yet? Weren't they getting married or something? <laughs> or was that... Did I dream that? <laughs> Why do you care? I don't know. <laughs> I care about people's feelings. I no, like, you don't. <laughs> I like it when people are happy. We got a bot. Try, not, to, try to read that. I'm uh, logged into my own account. Go ahead. Greg is like... <laughs> what is that even? <laughs> what is that even? I don't understand. I cut his hair. Mission accomplished. Damn it, bitch. Who cut I your kill hair? kill you. Who cut your hair? Not my wife. She said I cut... Yeah, oh, she, she cuts hair? Um, Not well. <laughs> no, because I think it looks no, good. I mean, no, she does fine. I'm just saying like... She can't do like a like a like a gay guy haircut. Like she, yeah, she's not gonna be able to do like some sort of style. But if you need a trim, she probably would. Oh, okay. Because I actually the best haircut I ever had was from your mom. Your mom can cut hair like a motherfucker. Yeah, get dudes, Gert dudes. I don't know, whatever. That's uh, yeah, a I abandoned him. I blocked him. Uh, Megan's like three hundred dollars an hour to watch. You're not worth that much. Um, well, I am by, and Greg is getting fucked. Oh, there you go. Well, it's pretty clear you're by. Sweet. No engagements, Trevor. Oh, okay. I I thought I thought you said something about you were gonna propose to her or something. Um, I didn't mean to scare scare you, Latina Angel. <laughs> thirteen. God, I hope you're not thirteen. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's just twelve other ones. <laughs> yeah, real uh, original. There's a lot more Mexicans than just twelve. So. <laughs> oh my God. Actually, yeah, and, and that's another thing I want to talk about. Uh -oh. So <laughs> everyone thinks America's so racist, dude. When I play WoW, okay, I play WoW with a lot of Mexicans and Australians. You have no idea what racism, racism is until you see Australians and Mexicans fight. It is fucking god-awful. Australians hate Mexicans so much. And that's why I keep thinking it's so funny. People are like, how come people aren't, you know, taking racism serious in America? I'm like, because compared to other countries, it is nothing. Like, I thought this one guy from Mexico was going to kill himself. These people were being so mean to him. They were telling about how, you know, they come abortions into his mother and stuff like that. <laughs> like, just sick shit. So, like, Australians, man, you got to tone it down a little bit. You're fucking crazy. <laughs> Australians oh. are awesome. Yeah, I know. The women are hot. Fucking right. They all say cunt. Yeah. I actually met a really, really unattractive uh, Australian once. Really? Uh, I didn't yeah. think they existed. Oh, yeah. She was not pretty. Because every Australian woman I've ever seen is, like, drop-dead gorgeous, and they're fucking crazy. Kate, or Greg and I actually went to high school with a girl who was Australian. You really? Remember her? I don't remember no. her name, but she was in your grade. I was doing drugs then, too. Jesus oh, Christ, man. Was there any time you weren't doing drugs? Not really. Like, you just popped out of your mom's vag and was like, give me some perks. Well, like, for, like, three weeks now. Pretty good. No, really? Yeah. So I've done drugs more than you in the last three weeks. Yes. Huh. Probably. Okay. <laughs> I do love perks, though, dude. I pop those shit. Like, I just want to pull, pour them in a big bowl and put milk in them, just eat them. <laughs> it's going to be like the next little It's better meat. if you break them down and mainline them. <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, see, Craig. the thing is, is like, you know, I thought perks were all just about the same formula, but I guess there's ones with Tylenol, ones without Tylenol, and blah, 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 blah. I'm like, Jesus Christ, man, what just happened to regular pills? You're, you're, you're being interrogated what? in the chat. <laughs> Who is me? No, uh, Greg. Oh, Megan they... says three weeks. Did you relapse? No, <laughs> he's just fucking around. No, no, he did not relapse. Relapse records. No, I got drug tested last Friday. I'm good. <laughs> Chelsea said the same thing. Greg, did you relapse? And you didn't call me. Oh, for... <laughs> <laughs> I told you guys. I told it. Bad. <laughs> now you know why, Chelsea and Megan. I didn't want you to meet Greg. You're a bunch of pushers. <laughs> he's bad. Bad influence. Yeah, they are, dude. All they do is push, man. <laughs> He's, he's not fucking using. He's fine. Yeah. He's just being a smart ass. Cause I that's wouldn't what he be here right now. Yeah, we, <laughs> we'd you, have to go looking for him. Are you still taking the shots of Trevor all in your butt? Yep. Trevor all. Trevor, whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Viva, Vivitron. Vivitron, yeah. Vitacom. That's, yeah, uh, that's your new go. name, Duffy. Trevor all. Actually, I probably won't be here. Next. I think I got to go next week. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, that reminds me. So, Jay explained to me a little bit about your story about your car. Explain oh, that to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why you missed last week. Why you had to miss last week. Yeah, I, I, had to, I had to drive for five hours to get a $600 fine. So you are still getting fined for it? Yeah, because I didn't report the car stolen. Because oh, okay. I didn't want to get the kids locked up. No, oh, okay. So, so Of course, he's dead now, so it doesn't really matter. But <laughs> Jesus Christ. I didn't report it stolen back then. So, 
So basically, like, some one cop came in and he asked. He he said some dude's name. Who the fuck is like Shaniqua? I don't know what the fuck it was. But Shaniqua. no, I did, apparently the kids let some other people use the car too. I was in rehab when it all happened, so I don't know what the fuck happened. So basically, the story is: is you were really high on heroin, you left your car somewhere, and someone stole it. No, um, I guess now because I'm already like sentenced, I can say what actually happened. <laughs> um, the the kids I was running with, the one that died, uh, they were homeless. So I was letting them sleep in the car. And, Aww, uh, how <laughs> nice. Yes. How the, nice. Sorry, well, I mean, sorry, just did the J. They, the they, they, they were like in the, the middleman of my drugs, so I was nah. I didn't give a fuck. Um, I knew they. Fi- I figured they were helping you out a little bit. If you're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, it, and I left the key in the car because they get out in the middle of the night and take a piss, and the alarm goes off for whatever fucking reasons. Fancy new car, whatever. Things and, like a spaceship. And I woke up one morning at like eight o'clock, and they're gone. I'm like, what the fuck? Of course it, they were. Yeah. So they called me about noon with some story about oh the drug dealer fucked us around, blah blah, blah all this shit. Um, they said, well, we got to steal some gas. We'll be there in an hour. We got some drugs for you, and I never seen them again. <laughs> and, and I was withdrawn, so I was trying to get a rehab at the time anyways. I didn't give a fuck. No, no. And That's apparently it. they got all kinds of tickets and all this shit. So they built Two up years a, ago. Yeah. So they built up a bunch of tickets and said you didn't report it stolen. You had to pay them. Yeah, I got mo- I got all of them but one dropped. Where where was this at? Was it around here? Or, no, uh, uh, down there. Down like there. City, okay. yeah. All right. I didn't want to name the city. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they dropped they dropped everything. Well, for two of, two of the tickets, the cop didn't even show up, so... Oh, yeah. just got that happens a lot, actually. And the judge, he judge said, well, you got to be accountable for something. He said, so you're going you're gonna to take this one. <laughs> like, All right, fuck it. Uh, so I drove five hours, just get $600 fucking Jesus fine. Jesus Christ. Lovely. Yeah. Fucking A. Megan man. says, me and Chelsea are coming on the show next week. Go for it. Yeah, you can come don't. in now, really. We don't care. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't know where we'd put you. Maybe on the shelf? They can sit on your lap. <laughs> no. No. I mean, I, you, I don't want the world to know at all that I show Megan any kind of affection. <laughs> I mean, you you and uh, Chelsea would have to sit between us, and you'd have to like sit on each Chelsea other's laps. Chelsea would laugh. probably just come in and suck Greg's dick. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, because uh, we only have one microphone for you since Greg won't be there. Yeah. Casey said no. What? I, I, I don't think he would say you no. Be- you, you, better, you better listen to me, bitch. Yeah. And those dishes better be done when I get out there. <laughs> I'm just joking. Thanks for doing my dishes. <laughs> if, you, if you want me to hold them down so you can kick them in the gut, be my guest. No, uh, that's why me and Megan get along. Like we just do nice stuff for each other all the time. Like you think I'm really mean to her? I'm actually like really good to her. Like she cooked me food one time, and uh, there was a bunch of dishes, so I did her dishes for her. Um, and then she got really moist because I even uh, took a paper towel and, and wiped down the sink and stuff, made sure there was no wet stuff. And uh, she about cummed. <laughs> And that's the thing. We just do nice. Like, I cooked her dinner tonight, and she did some of my dishes. Like, that's just the way we roll. I don't know. We roll. Yeah, that's the way we roll. <laughs> rolling, rolling, rolling. Yeah. I it's... hate to admit it, but I'm actually getting nostalgic for that kind of garbage music. Oh, I love it. I listen to Limp Biscuit. Well, you want to, you want some Limp Biscuit, right? Yeah, what, what was the one with all uh, that new metal? That song. What was the name of that album? Chocolate Starfish. No, that's my favorite Limp Biscuit album. Uh, I actually love that. Dollar album. Bill, y'all. No, that's the one in between that. The one I don't Nokia fucking know. Who, f- who actually knows that? I do. Who fucking knows that? I, I actually remember a long time ago, the hottest stripper I've ever seen in my life came out to Limp Biscuit, and I was like, I've never liked Limp Biscuit so much in my life. And then I got a lap dance sober, and it was the worst time of my life. Uh, <laughs> I think we just got an anime girl in the chat. Why? says, hello, guys. I'm not dangerous, just a little nervous. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I think we got an anime girl. Oh, why? why what, what screams anime about that? I don't know. I've been watching, looking at too many memes lately. <laughs> people people are creepy. <laughs> I was going to say, I don't, tell you. I don't know. I'm out of the loop with anime because I don't watch a lot of it. But I don't, I, I don't really either. Actually, I'm sort of turned on. What is this? Hello, guys. I am not dangerous. I'm just a little nervous. That's, that's sort of like, hey, uh, I'm going to suck your dick. <laughs> I think it's, I, I assume it's. It's probably a bot. No. Oh, she's laughing now. Oh, I don't know. I have no idea what that means. <laughs> um, definitely not a native English speaker. Yeah. Um, I don't know. We're so used to people coming in here that we don't know being bots. We're not. We don't know what to do right now. But we get a <laughs> bunch of viewers that don't talk. I don't understand that one either. Yeah, our chat's pretty active, I think. Yeah, between like four people. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, because it says like right now it says we have eleven, and uh, there's only like three of them talking. But I think that's broke. Because it says sometimes we have like 200, 300 people sometimes, so I don't fucking know. Well, no, a lot I'm of it. I'm pretty sure that's lying. A lot of it's. Yeah. Uh, it says 55 right now. No, it does. No, okay, that's yeah. 55 viewers. Like, some people pop in and pop out. Yeah. Once they realize that the show's not really their cup of tea. Well, you know? most of this stuff's still basically beta, anyways. Like, it's still new and everything like that. I talk too much. No, you don't, Mama Bear. I like when you talk. You, you, you talk some pretty funny stuff. And plus, you said that 
were your connection to the outside world, which we're very sorry for. Yeah, you you have a very fucked up worldview if you think that we're <laughs> we're any kind of normal. Yeah. Um, actually, Mama Bear, do you have kids? I know you're married and everything like that, but uh, I I forget if you have kids or not. Wet puff. What? What does that say? Wet poif. Wetty poif. Poif. That sounds like something uh, happens when a girl queefs. Like, that's the noise it makes. Wet it, wetty poof. Poof. <laughs> poof. Like, the sound it makes when it coming out of the vagina goes poof. And then the lips go. <laughs> they, <laughs> they flap like fucking uh, tractor trailer truck tire things or whatever. I enjoy this, yes, four girls. Four. Oh, there's four girls in the house. Oh, all my daughters. God, dude. Your husband. <laughs> <laughs> dude, she oh. might not have one. That could be rude. No, she says she has one. Oh, does she? Yeah. I don't remember. Because she said something. Uh, could be rude. Wait a minute. What? I don't know. He's worried about being rude. Jay, Jay always tries to be... Fuck is probably Jay, I'm, try, I'm the nice one here. Yeah, you Jay always suck. tries to be sensitive. And I'm like, Jay, stop being a little stop bitch. Stop being rude, guys. <laughs> Actually, when I touch his shoulder, like, Jay, Jay, stop. <laughs> That's what we're going to do I will that hurt, one. I will hurt you. I didn't know you hated that. That's so weird. I, I have a bubble, as you would say. Yeah. I, yeah, I figured you were married. But holy shit, man. Four <laughs> girls... So it's you, four girls, and the husband. Oh Jesus! That boy. I, I have a male cat in the house. That makes that's the only <laughs> that's the only freaking. Yeah, I thought it was bad that Jay has a wife and two freaking daughters. Jesus Christ, man! Yeah. I don't know how you guys can do it. I can barely handle one woman. Sometimes me and the cat look at each other like, "Oh crap, it's gonna <laughs> be a bad day." They're like, I'm, you both look at each other. They're like, we miss our balls. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Wet, wet, oh, wet poif is a bot. I enjoy this. Yes, four girls. Not those. Not, not that kind of four girls. Not the kind of four girls where you get paid for. <laughs> uh, yeah, that bot's name is Busim Slip. <laughs> uh, Mama Bear, we have been together about twenty years and have a small dog. Oh, okay, wonderful. It sounds so like they're right outside the door. I, they, I, think, I think they're they listening are. to us I think through the are. door. Chelsea, Megan, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Get away or come oh, in. Yeah, my guess. See, they're out there laughing like little schoolgirls. <laughs> <See, laughs> you guys can probably hear them. Yeah, fucking Megan laughs like Betty Rebel from R- Rebel, Flint's Rebel, whatever fucking name. It. Yeah, <laughs> that's exactly how she. Laughs. That's exactly how she has like twenty different laughs because she has twenty different personalities. Because she's crazy. Oh my god. Yeah, they're like right outside the right door. Outside the door. <laughs> Wait, you didn't think we could fucking hear you? <laughs> Jesus Christ. You're welcome to come in. No, I don't want them to come in. I don't want people to know what I'm touching. (laughs) (laughs) There you go. Come on in. Come on in. Come come on on in. Come on back here. uh, Fuck the camera up. Come on in. I can't hear you. I have my headphones in. Just to run into the camera. Oh, no. I'm accident prone. I'll break everything. You'll be fine. Come on in. Just come in for a quick. We're about to end the show. You can just come in and say hi real quick. Come on. Don't be scared. Don't be a little bitch. Greg will bite, but... Everything (laughs) burns. Don't hit the camera. Yeah, don't hit the, Watch camera. the camera. Come on back Where's here. Camera? That's, right there. The camera. There. That's the yeah. camera. Megan is very accident prone, so she might break something. You got to talk in the mic though, if you want to talk. Yeah. Here, say hi to everybody. Hi, everybody. Hi. All 14 people. people. Yeah, all 14 people. The one in the black's Megan. The one in the gray is Chelsea. Uh, yeah, Chelsea's the one that's wearing the koala bear. Uh, thing. <laughs> You're knocking shit over. Yeah, don't hit the cord out like pull the fucking cord. <laughs> yeah, there, don't mess with yeah, that. Don't. Go. Bye. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. Yeah, don't. Bye, guys. And, and they're just knocking everything off the wall. <laughs> don't hit the camera. Watch the camera. Did you finish my dishes? <laughs> oh, that's fucked up. You bitch. See you guys. <laughs> Have a good one. God bless. So there you I, go. yeah, that was Chelsea and Megan. Uh, Megan was the ugly hey, one. Girlfriend. <laughs> Oh my god, you're such an asshole. <laughs> yeah, I can't help it. <laughs> oh, about to die. You are such an asshole. Hi and bye, ladies. Mama Bear says if you can hear us. Yeah, um, Chelsea and Megan. Mama. Mama, 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 mama Bear said hi. Yeah, uh, believe it or not, you might not look like it, but there's actually quite a bit of room back here. <laughs> yeah, there is. After uh, they knocked off uh, Tie Dye Bear. Uh, <laughs> that fucking bear, though, man. <laughs> I know, dude. I don't know where else to put it. Usually when I don't know else to put some, I put it in a butthole. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that was Megan and Chelsea. Uh, we're about out of time, though. Thanks to everyone for coming tonight to chill with us. You know, Greg hit the cord out and ruined it. <laughs> but, Better uh, hitting the cord than hitting the, hitting the lines. Yeah. Uh, it's always good to hit the G spot. So, uh, thanks again, everybody. Uh, have a good one and use a condom. And don't let your meatloaf.
I have a good one. Don't let your meat loaf. Yeah. <laughs> what? Peace. <laughs> good joke. <laughs> Bye. This has been the Openly Hostile Opinions Podcast. <laughs>